Those last minute goals, the comebacks, even the defeats are all part of this great football club of ours and it's been an unbelievable experience for all of us. Old Trafford, the home of Manchester United, the home of the most successful club in English football and one of the most prestigious clubs in world football, winning 20 league titles, 11 FA Cups, 4 League Cups, 20 Community Shields, 3 Champions Leagues, 1 UEFA Winners' Cup, 1 UEFA Super Cup and 1 FIFA Club World Cup. In the past 26 years since 1986, the team has been managed by Sir Alex Ferguson, bringing men many memorable moments and trophies to Old Trafford. Every game, 76,000 fans pack into Old Trafford and great vibrant atmospheres such as this. Old Trafford is one of the most difficult places in the world for opposition teams to come and get a result, even more so when 76,000 passionate United fans are right behind the team. I mean the start, the going out and all those flags and the atmosphere today was unbelievable the whole game. So I'm very, very proud of my, my fans, they were great, really great. The fans have been brilliant, um, I've said all along, um, the fans here have been fantastic with me and um, you know it's it's great the, the reception I, I, get, I get here so um, hopefully I can repay them. Manchester United are famous for creating some of the greatest players the planet has ever seen. With a catalogue of legends to choose from it gives the club a great history. Ryan Giggs, arguably the club's greatest ever player, has made the most appearances for the club. Sir Bobby Charlton, the club's all-time top scorer with 249 goals. Dennis Law, with his prolific scoring record. The club has created many more iconic players past and present, such as Paul Scholes, George Best, Roy Keane, Eric Cantona, Cristiano Ronaldo and Gary Neville. This is just a selection of many Old Trafford legends. The Stretford End, the stand where the crowd really is at its loudest. Famous for spreading the club's most famous chants around the stadium and creating wonderful atmospheres to keep inspiring the team. The Stretford End and the rest of the stadium have seen many wonderful moments and trophies won at Old Trafford. But it's not always been happy times for the club and its fans. As on the 6th of February 1958, disaster struck. An attempting takeoff, it brushed some trees at the end of the runway, then dropped 60 feet into a house and a gasoline storage shed. 21 died in the crash, 23 more are gravely injured. A shocking disaster that has a doubly great impact on Britain, for on the passenger list was the Manchester United soccer team. National champions, they were returning from Belgrade after tying Yugoslavia's crack team in the European Championship competition. Headed for the semi-finals, they were national heroes, every man. 
the unforgettable tragedy that is the Munich air disaster will live on as one of football's most tragic memories. With eight Manchester United players sadly being lost and three members of staff also is an iconic moment in the club's history. Sir Matt Bosby, the manager who survived the crash, was left with a team which would struggle to regenerate as Sir Mark continued to manage the team and start rebuilding, going on to win two league titles, an FA Cup, two Community Shields and a European Cup. He is regarded as an Old Trafford legend, which created a motto within Old Trafford, Manchester United will never die and Manchester United will rise again.